Hello, happy Saturday. Welcome to my new little segment called Spotlight Saturday, where I'm going to try and spotlight or highlight um, at least two products that I use and that I have that belong to a produce of mine and um, share with you. You can always I use them and maybe some other ideas for you so that if you are curious to know more about certain products, then this could be the place for you. And feel free to share this video afterwards if you see it. If uh, you see you know someone else who might like something specific that I um, showcase for you. Okay. So what I'm going to focus on today is <clears throat> the um, Sip Top Utility Organizing Utility Tote. Okay. This is uh, thirty-five dollars. Okay. And um, this one is the one I use for work all the time. It's embroidered with my name. This pattern is no longer around. Um, there are plenty of other patterns. It comes in like 11 different patterns and styles. Uh, personalization that you can do as well, and that's extra. Um, but it has a total of seven pockets. There are five of these little pockets that can hold water bottles, um, your keys, you know, extra little pins or markers you want handy, whatever you want to use it for. Um, and then it also has two mesh pockets, one on the out this side and one on this side. Okay, so the seven all together. <clears throat> and the handles you can fit on your shoulder, the shoulder bag. And this one I use for my work. Um, so it has a zipper top on the top of it. So I can keep things in there, you know, some private things if you don't want um, things that everyone can just see. It does have zip top for privacy and security. Um, and then inside mine, there's lots of space. Inside mine is my other product that I'm going to show you today, which is our fold and file system. So let's get that out of there. This is not something you have to put in the zip top utility tote. Um, it does make it a little more sturdy and stand upright, but it's totally optional to do that. Um, so you can see inside of it, I've got plenty of room inside there without the fold and file. Okay, so some people use these as diaper bags, work bags. My daughter uses hers to call around her um, instrument or band and her all her music. She also puts books in it for the library. Um, lots of teachers use these; they love these. But also, you know, diaper bags and book bags and all kinds of other bags you can use them for. So then, this um, fold and file is twenty five dollars. This is the same pattern. I also have one upstairs that I use for my little. Um, Desk center, command center, it holds um, all things that I need in there. So we have some mesh pockets. Okay, there are two of these. Um, this one, because it's for work, I have glue stick and notepad and stuff in mine. Okay. And then inside, it can hold standard hanging file folders. Um, but mine, hold it up here for you. See, inside holds um, all, my laptop. I have my MacBook in here. I have my iPad in here, I have papers I need to grade, and I even <clears throat> have uh, some clipboards in here, and I even also have other pouches in here that I have that I hold, um, pencils and grading pens and stuff that I have for, like my cords for my charger. I have fit a lot of stuff in just the bolded file. And then when I put that inside my zip top utility tote, then I'm able to carry all of it around nice, organized, and easy. So it can be an office on the go. Um, it's just for me an easy way to haul my school stuff back and forth to school. <clears throat> so all together, if you bought them both as a pair, which you do not have to, but if you do, um, they work great together. They're $60 for both. Um, this one does collapse easy for storage. If you wanted to store it for periodically, it does fold down and can be flat. Um, you can use them separately. You can use them together. Totally your choice. So. Um, Thank you for much for watching this inaugural Spotlight Saturday. And um, feel free to again to share the video with your friends and anyone else you know who's interested, family members who are interested in 31. And um, happy Saturday.